Welcome back to the channel folks. We are in the kitchen for this little review and today we're going to be looking at this little item. It is by Sainsbury's Chicken Chop Frizzy with Long Grain Rice. Now this cost £1.75 with a nectar card. If you don't have a nectar card this item will cost you £2. So on the front of the box here we can see it says it is a medium heat. It's given two chilies. And if I bring it a bit of closer there, we can look at the little traffic light system. And we can see their fat is 10.1 grams, of which saturates 1.4, sugar 7.7, salt 1.74 grams. It's just some details telling us to keep it frozen. We all know that. And there we have it, the beautiful looking meal that we're going to enjoy very shortly. On the side, nothing to see, nothing to see. Best before, just nothing to see. So let's get straight to the back. Chicken breast pieces in a medium spiced tomato sauce with long grain rice. And over this side here we have nutritional table. And also our ingredients below, so I'll just keep that still for you and you can have a look. Tell me what you think. And it is 400 grams of food. Now this is what we're looking for here. We can oven cook this. If you want to oven cook it, um, you need to put it in your fan assisted oven, which is what I have, most people have, for 45 minutes. But we are going the microwave option. Great results. Microwave from frozen, but also cook in the oven. Before cooking, remove outer packaging and pierce film. Place on non-metallic plate. During cooking, cook for five minutes. Peel back film lid. Add two teaspoons of water to the rice, stir both sections, recover and continue cooking. After cooking, stir thoroughly, check food is piping hot, allow to stand for one minute. Do not reheat once cooled. All cooking appliances vary. This is a guideline. This is a guide only, sorry. Right. So, microwave on full power for nine minutes. Any 100 watt microwave. Seven and a half and nine. 100 watt microwave, so we will go about 10 minutes, I think. Let's get a look at the product. So it's got a little hole here for you to get the thumb in for easy access. Whoa, look at that. And there we have the item itself. Yeah, like double sectioned. Curry, rice. So we'll pierce this first. And we'll get it in the microwave and we'll bring it out, put some water in the rice as it suggests. So yeah, let's do that. Let's get it in the microwave. Well, there we go. That is the first little rotation done in the microwave. So let's um, give it a bit of a mix and add the water. It's still quite frozen at the bottom there. But I must tell you folks, it does smell mighty divine. Plenty of bits of chicken there. But we'll, um, we'll check that out after we get it completely cooked. So we'll just add some water to the rice. Give it a little bit of a mix. That should do. We'll put it back into the microwave. And next time you see it, it'll be ready to eat. Nice and piping hot, the way we like it. So yeah, I think we'll just serve it onto the plate and then get a look at what we're working with. The rice is a bit congealed together, but it'll be fine, it'll break up. A little bit dried out, but it's, it'll be grand. Maybe a little bit more water would have worked out better there, but as I say, once the sauce smells on it, it'll be fine. Let's just put it all on. Well, there's plenty of sauce too, so we're okay, folks. We're okay. And as I said before, it smells really good. Let's have a bit of a look at the chicken quantities. There's one, two, Three, 
four, five, six, seven pieces of chicken there, and they're, they're reasonable enough sized. And then we've plenty of peppers and onions chopped up and stuff there. So it looks good, first impressions anyway, and it smells great. Let's do this. I think we'll start off with a nice bit of succulent chicken. Yeah, the quality of that chicken is fine. Nice little bit of saucy rice, peppers, or there's no peppers on that bit, so it's just onions and rice and sauce. Well, that's good. That tastes really, really, really nice. Well, it's actually, it is spicier than I thought it was going to be. But it's not overwhelming, and it's just a nice little kick on the back of the throat. Unexpected, but nice. Some more rice, pepper, and sauce. Yeah, that's good. Some rice on its own to see how it turned out, because I say there's a little clump together a bit. No, it's fine. It's not too dried out, it's, it's grand. It's not hard, it's, it's just dead on. Worked out okay. Let's get a nice big, some pepper, some sauce, some onion, and chicken. That sauce is delicious. It's really good. The chicken seems to be the sort of same quality of chicken that you get in most of these school curry meals, so there's no difference there. But it's good to stay on. Yeah. That wee bit there was slightly rubbery, but you know, it's what you expect to get in these meals. Let's try it a little bit. Yeah, that was much softer. I just eat all the chicken actually. And see out of all those, what's it, five, six bits? I forget now. If it, there were any of them, or like that bit, I just had their one bit back. If you know what I'm, you know what I'm trying to say, the rubbery bit. That's looking soft. All of that chicken. Yep. Not a bit of chicken. Yeah, so. Of all the chicken we got, there was one bit that was slightly, I'm not, when I say rubbery, it just means it was a bit more chewy than the other pieces. A lot of pieces were melting your mouth soft. Had to chew that a bit more. No big deal, but I'm just trying to report as much back to you as I can. So I'm just going to mix it all up now. And have a few more spoonfuls of this delicious sauce, rice and veg now because the chicken's all out and then we'll give a bit of a verdict so there's a bit full of peppers mmm that is really nice and shall crazy isn't something I really go for but that is mighty fine that's an excellent little lunch today for me that'll set me up nicely for a a little run later on. Yeah, what can I say, folks? Too? There's a red pepper. Rice, 100%. Sauce, 100%. Veg, 100%. Chicken, one that'll give you a bit, but the rest was fine. Can't complain. £1.75. Decent quality. Little meal. Handy, convenient. Ready in 10 minutes. But, what did the app say? As you can see there, it got 84 out of 100, an excellent score. With no other, nothing to report, no hazardous substances in it, so I think that's a winner winner chicken dinner in my eyes. Yeah, because there's anything more I can tell these folks, anything more I can say about it, other than it tastes really good, really going to enjoy it. Just wish there was more, so I'll have this here in no time. But yeah, like I said, the sauce is excellent, excellent. 
the spice is just perfect for somebody that isn't into real spicy food but likes a little, you know, a little flavour. So yeah, it's a winner with me. Would I buy that again? Yes, definitely. Now, it's £1.75 with an actor card, like I said. But I think that's reasonable because that, that's that's decent. That's a decent meal, that's decent quality. And it's so convenient, it's handy. Score was good in the app. Yeah, I'm happy to buy them again. So, what score would I give this? I'm going to give it an 8. I think that deserves an 8. You know, it's, it's tasty. I'm really going to enjoy it. Plenty of chicken. Plenty of sauce. It's a, it's a good little meal. Anyway, folks, nice and simple. Easy to review, easy to show you. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.